issue I want to address is um, I want to make a record specifically as it relates to the restraints that the Sheriff's Department utilized during this case given a comment made by Mr. Brooks when the jury was coming out the very last time. Um, I don't recall if you said something about a stun belt or uh, shock shackles. Or something to that effect but it was inaccurate I have asked the Sheriff's Department to provide photographic documentation of the shackles that were utilized in this case but I felt it important to have a thorough record of the restraints that were utilized the photographs that have been provided are on a compact disc they will be filed as court exhibit 3 but they will remain under seal um, and that is because of the security concerns related to how the Sheriff's Department um, secures inmates uh, during a trial um, and I would just further note that during the trial when Mr. Brooks would be brought from the holding area into the courtroom this courtroom was closed to the public um, and that was really to maintain that um, privacy if you will or secrecy if you will regarding the restraint system and so I believe it's important that that information not be released to the public um, it will be available of course to the court and the parties um, and if there is an appeal, any attorney that may represent you can certainly look at that, but it'll otherwise uh, be under seal. So Why would that? The record is very clear on the restraint system that was utilized during this trial. I, I have a question to that. Okay. Why, why, is that, why is that remaining sealed, but everything else being open to the public? That's, I've indicated my reasons are on the record. I'm not going to restate them. So. Well, I think, I think that the public, if they're, if they're allowed to see uh, search warrant information and things like that, then I think that they should know that it was a shock device on my ankles. That there was, was no shock device. It on was your a ankle, shock sir. device. I was told it was a shock device. Mr. Brooks. And That's it was why covered up. The it was covered up by black cloth. So the jury purposely could not see it and so that the public cannot see it. I was told that a chair had to be placed on my side so that no one can see that I was shackled with ankle shocks. I think the public should know that. The jury should have known that. That's what they were. Mr. Brooks, I've made my ruling. Um, your characterization I, I respect your of those ruling, but it as, should be it should be noted. Your it should be noted. noted for the record. It should be noted that I had a shock device on my ankles. That's fact. It it's is a not fact. A fact sir. It is a fact. I'm the one that had them on my ankles. I inquired about what they were. Obviously, I'm going to require about what's being put on my body. I was told that they were a shock device, which I know how a shock device looks because I've I've been through this before in Milwaukee. So I know I know what a shock device is. It was clearly a shock device that was purposely not shown to the jury or to the public. Purposely not. And then now you're saying that it's going to be sealed. Well, why should it be sealed? The right, public Mr. doesn't Brooks, deserve, you're, you're, the public deserves to know. You've made a record. The and public it's deserves noted. to know about and uh, things, things pertaining to a, a, a search warrant, but not the fact that I was limited by a shock device. That if I moved the wrong way, I could have got shocked with all this vote. It's absolutely false that you that have a shock device. That is not false. On, and you know that it's not false. Well, I have the photographs. Well, show that the photographs. Where's the photographs? Where's the photographs? And they you will just be said they would be sealed. Why, why do they need from to be public sealed? View. Why do the they reasons need to be that I've already from the indicated. Why do they need to be sealed Mr. Brooks, from the public? I need to move on to scheduling. Can we move on to subject matter jurisdiction that hasn't been proved for the record? All right, so Can we move on to that? Mr. Brooks, I really don't want to remove you from the courtroom today. It, but I, I, need I don't, to I don't want to be removed, but you're not going to sit here and tell me on the record what was on my body when I was told what it was. That's inaccurate. And I, I refuse. At a, at a later Honor, point in time, I Honor, would put, I refuse to sit here and let you make an inaccurate record. When you know that it was, in fact, a shock device. That's why I had the black cloth in front of the table so it couldn't be shown. That's, that's why I had a chair sitting on the side of me that was told needs to cover up the fact that I had a shock device on my ankles. 
And it's, I think it's very, very, very unfair and it's dishonorable to get on a record and not tell the truth. I'm not trying to dishonor you, Your Honor. I'm not trying to disrespect you. I'm not trying to disrespect your court. I just want the truth to be told. That should not be sealed. If, if, if everything else could be open to the public, then the public should know that I had a shock device on my ankles. That was purposely not shown to the jury or to the public. They should know that. All right, thank you, Mr. Brooks. I disagree wholeheartedly with your well, characterization. Well, it's, it's not true. Mr. Brooks, I didn't interrupt you. Please it's not don't true. interrupt me. It's not true. Mr. Brooks? Well, I'm, I'm, I'm quite sure there's cameras rolling right now because there are always cameras rolling. There's always audio on. Mr. Brooks, I need there's to public, move on to there's scheduling. There's public in the courtroom. I had a shock device on my ankles. And they purposely did not want to show that to you guys or to the jury. Mr. That's Brooks, why I can only move I'm advising you. Here or here. Mr. Brooks, I'm advising why. you. And I always had the chair right here. Everybody that came in this courtroom seen that I had a chair right here, even though I had no counsel. What is the reason for me to have a chair right here? Right. Mr. Brooks, why any further, black cloth any in further the interruptions table? will result in you being removed to the other courtroom okay. because and you're you not letting me move, move on okay. to scheduling. Is it civil contempt or criminal contempt? All right. One more interruption and you will go to the other courtroom. Well, they need, they need to know that. Stop. They need to know that. They need to know the truth. I'm going to ask the state some questions. If you interrupt when I do that, you will be removed to the okay, other courtroom. Okay, remove me in. All right, remove attorney. Me in. Attorney Basie. It's not going to stop the fact that they need right. to know that he, shock he's device interrupted. On my I'm sorry, everyone. We'll have to clear the courtroom. He'll be removed to the other courtroom. I'll that's, make that's the appropriate fine. findings. Tell the truth, though, Your Honor. Tell the truth. I have a shackle. I have a shock device Captain, on my ankles. Captain, can I please see you? We're off. We're